Morning guys, it's Tim from Advanced Think Car Tech as per usual. Right, so something a little bit different today for us and I'm just doing a little video more so so that we can link it to the listing on the website. But um, a lot of people in the VW Transporter T6 have this 12 volt socket. Whilst it's handy for some, it doesn't look that great. Um, and it's a bit, bit of a pain in the ass because people normally want USB charging points that you can just go straight in for, I don't know, things like dash cameras or TomTom Tom navigation systems or stuff like this. So customers in having a comfort dash install anyway and as part of uh, another extra that he wants fitted is we're going to remove this 12 volt socket and we are going to fit one of our premium uh, USB sockets. He's opted for a dual one and you can see it here. So this is going to directly replace him here with our own custom made uh, wiring loom that is ready to go. We sell a complete kit so that it's it even comes with the drill saw so that you can entirely fit it yourself. There's, there's different versions, either dual or single, um, front facing, rear facing, all of that sort of jazz. Anyway, um, so these, these USB charging ports are really, really cool because there's lots on the market that cause issues with people's vans. Some just are, they say that they're, own, they're outputting five volts at 2.1 amps, but they're lying they're not they're, the cheap ones on ebay are just terrible 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 they couldn't cause interference and when you're charging things like ipads and bigger phones and bigger samsungs and all that those cheap nasty ones just don't output what they're saying they're doing and and they, they just don't do it now these ones are really cool because they are c e and e marked um, they are also got certain fire certifications so that if in the event of a of a fault or a failure they will shut themselves down so that they don't cause a fire or melt any wiring and stuff like that and uh, they don't create any interference which is the main thing a lot of people complain about so uh, rambling on a bit uh, we're going to be fitting this in a second and when it's all in it won't be the most exciting video just literally showing you a USB port charging something and uh, we'll show you what it can output hopefully um, if I can find the tool and uh, yeah stay tuned okay so rich has now finished uh this t6 upgrade so as part of this he's uh, done the comfort dash with the, the new gloss things and all the all the lovely panels um so as you can see we've now got a new dual usb charging point uh rather than this 12 volt socket which you'd have to have up and then something stuck into it so um just to show you how it works which is very very simple um you've got the option to plug in two devices um, using my very old iPhone cable we'll get my iPhone and this customer wanted it so that uh, it was wired on ignition all the time so we'll just plug it in and there you go charging whilst the vehicle is off which is what he wanted um, nice and neat so if you, he's got a, um, a special mount here so that will go bit like that um, he also charges his iPad uh, in this section here so can just a nice little cable just to run off there um, to allow him to do that as well and just makes it much more functional much more neat and tidy and just an, an all-round better uh, use of this this area so if you've got a vehicle doesn't necessarily need to be a t6 but want USB charging um, we can we can fit it here we can fit it into the the comfort dash or your normal dash into your glove box door cards whatever um but just get in touch with us uh we'll link to the product in the description and one of the cards will pop up as well um if you enjoy these videos specifically the transporter t6 stuff then just make sure you subscribe it really does help us out click that little bell notification as well um, and you'll be notified every time we upload a new video and as always thanks for watching <laughs>